you got to see some stuff for sure on both ends. And we're going to get started with game numero uno. Yep. Yeah, and obviously uh, Radish King has uh, has some Incineroar experience. Nothing near the level of Sky J. But uh, let's see if that experience will come in handy here. Uh, if even a little bit as Radish King waits out that revenge. That's one thing you got to be able to do. Neutralize those revenge uh, opportunities uh, for Incineroar. Because if you let them get that going, it's over. Oh, yeah, great job sure. once again, waiting it out. Yeah, for sure, absolutely. And honestly, you know, for those of you who don't know, Radish, not at the level of Sky J, like you said earlier, but, you know, does have some experience against Incineroar, right? And it can be really scary, though. You know, you kind of know what's coming. It just, it just like, when is it coming, right? That's the best question to ask if you're Radish King, right? You know the Revenges are going to come in disadvantage or in a win right there, just like that. Misses the side B, eats a, eats a forward smash. Not Nothing just yet, though, but, man, Revenge Fair going to trade and do a lot of damage. Ooh, that f tilt almost catching the roll. Are we going to get a back throw? No, looking for the kill instead. And Radish King converts, gets the kill with the down throw into the Cyclone. And here we go. Oh, oh, here comes the damage, right? Here comes the pain train. You got to be careful, but doesn't get yeah. anything. And he tried to swipe him for that. You know he was going to try to back throw or something there. Yeah, Radish King, not the most uh, proficient with the zero to death. You know, no. compared to other Luigi's. No, but what he does do that's a little bit different than some of the other Luigi's is he's able to read where you're going and yeah. ends up customizing the combo right to yeah. still get 50, 60, 70, 80 damage. Right? Yeah, so, exactly. And an occasional zero, zero death, death every now and then. Yeah, for sure. However, we, saw it, uh, we saw it earlier. We did right? see it earlier. However, Sky J, though, is going to take that stock. Finally, off of Radish, eats 92%. And I mean, Incineroar, you know, you can't, you can't sleep on this character at all. However, you got to be careful with your Radish. But, you know, Spot dodges through the side Vs, right, but not able to punish. However, he's beating Sky J halfway with these rising fares, right, to kind of keep him from trying to land or anything like that. So this is scary. Gets the Nair. This is the way Radish is just not letting Sky J land. It's huge right now. Oh, not quite going to get the kill. 171. And Incineroar, scary, scary character. But Radish King taking that stock before anything, uh, anything crazy happens. Now back to ledge. Oh, that... Almost revenge. Yeah, absolutely, man. This is so scary. Just the way. Oh, but unfortunate. Okay, that that okay. That was the best. That was the best outcome from for that mishap right there from Radish, right? He got sent towards center stage. Just like, all right, cool. I'll take it. I'll take it. It could have been a lot worse. He could have been sent off stage. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, oh my Radish goodness. King. Oh my goodness. Radish King, you're nuts. The ah. edge guard. Sky J's gonna go down a game. Radish King put on his. Oh my god, Houston showing dude, up. Please, no, dude. Houston showing I, I, up. I can't. My heart. My heart was racing last set. I can't see it happen again right yeah. now, dude. No, please. Please, I'm begging you, man. Yeah, Radish King just seeing that opportunity, taking it, and that's what you gotta do, right? You gotta maximize the opportunities that you find. Not necessarily force the openings, but when you have them, to be able to recognize them, take them, and maximize them. And Radish King did that just right there. And here we go into game two. Can Radish King continue this? Will Sky J pull a Meister and quiet down the crowd a little bit? Absolutely. And that's the thing, right? So we talked about how Nico has a lot of experience in the Game & Watch matchup. And, you know, I'm not sure how often these guys play, but, you know, in Mexico, Waka, uh, being right. a Luigi from Tijuana, which is a little bit far from Puebla, wherever Sky J is from. Uh, that's where he's from, from Puebla. But, however, when you do play against these, you know, these characters, you, you remember things, right? And let's see if Sky J can kind of tap in into that EG knowledge and maybe try to, you know, oh, again, silence the haters. Yeah. But yes, we saw that. That was crazy. Oh, <gasps> barely missing the revenge. That would have been so big for Sky J, especially uh, that's Luigi's weakness, right? But even so, managing to snipe that recovery right there, taking that first stock. So good by Radish King. Sniping out the jump. Yeah, absolutely. And something we saw, we saw Sky J run off low recovery snipe it out with the fair something we talked about you know earlier before we played nice up smash right we talked about how sky j knows people want to recover low consistently so he's always ready to meet people with that here comes the grab though however at the at the edge you yep. know you couldn't really do anything so sadly all you get if you're luigi uh, is that down air gets a revenge right there great delay on the timing to avoid the down tilt but even so sky j's ledge trap flow chart just a little bit too strong right now 
Yeah, so good stuff, right? The way Luigi is like sort of floaty, right? And kind of, you know, the aerial drift makes right. it really hard for you to kind of figure out where he's trying to land. Mm -hmm. Gets the weak plunger hit into the. Oh, no, okay, dude, what the, Radish. What the he fuck? He is not afraid to do those types of You're options. You're kidding me, dude. You Radish, gotta have it does balls. not matter who you are. Radish King will will go for the crazy stuff. For sure. You're, so much respect you're nuts, for that. Yeah. Dude. Yeah. Absolutely. This is so scary, though. You can't eat a hit right here. You're gonna explode if you're Radish. Can't get a trade right. Oh, oh you're that's dead. You're death. Super dead. Insanely super dead. dead. Yeah, you're insanely dead. But man. Oh, what a delay! That was yeah. such a good delay on that nair. Dude, Radish King, again, we talked about it earlier, being one of the players who doesn't travel or doesn't enter very often, but it's just so naturally talented that he's able to keep up with everybody that's been grinding like crazy. Seeing it right now against SkyJ, right? Here we go. Edge guard. Oh, Radish King back there on offstage. Great, that great was stuff. So good. That Radish was SkyJ. Basically doing what Radish did to him game one. Absolutely. He said, so. take this gimp right back at you. Yep. Once again, we talked about it earlier, right? You know, after talking to Sky, you're talking to Meister a little bit off stage, kind of or off stream, right. kind of talking a little bit about, you know, how you're feeling going into this, you know, things that you're noticing. Something he tells me is lower level players are not as not globally top players consistently recover low and Sky J mm. able to snipe that out twice yeah. in that set. You know, with the runoff fair, right, covering the low recovery and getting that gimp right there with the neutral air, right? Right, because so. generally recovering low, it's a safe option. It's but not easy to cover a lot of times, right? But, but top players yeah. already know, hey, I know how to shark this out, right? Absolutely. So going to get, you know, a, you know, on Battlefield, right? Going to get this uh, triple platform going. Oh, you're dead. You're dead. Radish King responding accordingly, man. Yeah, Radish basically saying, hey, you're not allowed to make any mistakes against me either. You yeah, know? Absolutely. One of the biggest things, right? That's the big top player factor, right? Is top players kill you for mistakes and Radish King doing exactly that to a top player himself. Oh! You're you're crazy. No dude. respect for Radish King. No. Absolutely no. none. Yeah, speaking of no respect, you're gonna eat that side B for sure for damage. Oh. And once again, we talked Sky about it Jingle. earlier. Oh misses. Can't Oh my god. Oh my that goodness. Been so crazy. Oh my goodness. They're both they're both at each other's throats. Oh you're super dead. You're Across stage it No you're not dead! He lives! You're not dead! It just does a lot of damage, man. That's crazy. However, the next oh, grab, yeah. up throw, it's gonna be it. Two disguise. Three two one blast off right in on Houston soil. But however, Radish can looking to try to close out this stock and man, these games have been high octane, yep. high pace big matches to say the least slobber knockers man like they're so close and good catch right there gets the you know messes up the input right to kind of keep radish in disadvantage at ledge right in order to kind of get him to maybe mash a resource right Ooh, radish getting a little bit too far on positioning wise with that back air gonna get punished for it 172 this is so scary with all that rage same recovery. Oh, but no Radish trade. is going to take that trade. He's yeah, going to take yeah, that trade any day. He's fine with it. He's any fine with it for sure. day of the week. Radish King, Sky J, 1 1, one stock apiece. Game three. What a set so far. Yeah, invincibility right there. Gets a little bit of priority with that down B if you're Luigi, the Cyclone. You got to be careful with your Sky J, right? Just how Sky J has that revenge in order to stop the combos, the combo break, as well as Nair. EG has the same thing, right? In a way, they're kind of a similar archetype of character, right? Except, you know, Incineroar just hits a little bit harder for sure, right? Yeah, SkyJ catching a lot of these aggressive recoveries, aggressive ch uh, or attempts to get back on stage by Radish King. Nice patience by Radish King that time. Uh, not giving SkyJ the roll, not giving SkyJ the jump. Oh, but the fair is going to outrange the Luigi fair. Yeah, absolutely right. That's something that we've noticed a lot. That's actually something that we've been noticing a lot is we're starting to see Sky J be able to outrange Radish King, right? And again, snipes out the low recovery, and Sky J gonna take a two-one lead. The Houston crowd a little bit, you know, kind of encouraging their boy, but like you gotta, you gotta be a little bit louder, you know. Yeah. Like the same love that everybody was showing for Nico, you gotta, you gotta show the same love back for Radish King, yep. right? Like, you know, just the fact that Radish King is able to, you know. Skyji is a top 50, top 100. Top 100 for sure. Oh, Maybe yeah. top 50 player globally, man. Yeah. Radish King keeping up. Like, that just goes to show how naturally talented someone is, you know, regardless of matchups, regardless of player history, regardless of anything, right? Yeah, but it's now Radish King, hometown favorite. In the hot seat. Facing elimination, yeah. Facing elimination, exactly. But no gets losers the combo. bracket. If you're dead, 
Oh. It sweet spots. It doesn't sweet spot. That's unfortunate, man. That's so unfortunate. Get 75%. However, you know, if you don't kill Incineroar, that's even scarier, right? Yeah, only 28% though on the punish from uh, from Sky J. I feel like you take that. Oh, still hasn't been able to do anything about that low recovery, right? Just yeah. getting sniped out of that low recovery. I know Radish King is trying to opt for these low recoveries because he doesn't want to get side beat reversal yep. off stage. However, if Sky J continues to snipe these out, you gotta you gotta mix it up, man. Sky J knows. Sky J is someone to pick up on a habit and just exploit it consistently. Again, going low, you're yeah. Dead. Forced low you're recovery dead. with the the Mr. Lowland whip, and that's so smart by Sky J. Yeah. Tournament stock for Radish King if he can't close this out. Man, this is gonna be crazy. One for the ages. Luigi for sure. factor? Luigi factor? Oh, he messes. Oh. He didn't recognize the Sky J managed to DI behind. Yeah, absolutely. That's so scary, though. However, Radish King gonna look to try to get something started, right? You really need to here if you're Radish King. Because this is this is so scary. That there did 34 damage, oh, dude. Radish going a little bit higher there. Neutral? Get up. Up B. What the heck? Radish King. Oh, but he gets grabbed. 71 off stage. Low recovery once again. Sky J gonna opt to go for the two frame. Try to get the down to oh, up tilt. He has no choice but to go low now, right? Oh, what a you what a recovery. Back. You make it back. A grab will be it here. Back gets, throw? Not quite. This is so scary. Radish King, you gotta be able to win. You gotta make it back if you wanna force this to a game. Oh, oh and Radish King oh presses the God. side beat at the blast zone. That's gonna shift his hurt box a little bit. He is going to lose that stock.